Hi guys, Jackie here from Jackie Talks. Um, so this is sorry, we just got low boy. Um, an update about Chris and EXO. I do want to apologize if this video is long, but there's been so many rumors going on, which I honestly don't think they're gonna stop. Oh, rumors, yes, I tweeted one. It is currently a rumor. I did tweet after that saying if it is a rumor, it is in whatever. Of one starting with Chris having a condition or heart problem, um, doing to working so much and, and stress and not getting enough rest. This that anyone thing that's got a lot of saying that we're not one hundred percent sure this is true. It is current and normal. Um people saying that his friend posted that or what saying walk home. I didn't read it. I'm not one hundred percent sure it's true or what I guess medical records was leaked or something. That is also a rumor of what I'm not one hundred percent sure about that. But if it is true, then SM has F up. Um, but again, it's a rumor. But uh, in my opinion, it could happen. Um, being stressed so much and working and not getting enough rest. It could happen and he could be having only call problems. Who knows? No one knows for sure if it's true, if it's fake. Not until a statement is released by Chris or by his lawyers or anyone. So, yes, right now that is a rumor. But you never know the truth. And if it is, and SM was pushing him yet to do stuff, then that's just okay. Honestly. Um, also, um, Chris has updated a little bit. He broke his hands a little bit, not too much, not one hundred you know, what but um he posted on Revo Revo I don't know how to say it. And Instagram. Um saying that he's okay, he thanks for the support and that that I forgot how to say it. his name or oh. The name he put will always be your side. Any time. Do a video. Um. So we did hear from him. I, it did quiet some people. Some people is saying it might not have been him or what. But. I, I, I think it was. Um. So I'm glad that he did post and he said he was okay. That he does. He said thank you for the support and being on his side and pretty much everything like that. It's not fair. Um, the English poem and that we who who I don't know how you say will always be here. So again, honestly, I do think he has left EXO and well S M and EXO. If you want to believe in that, I do honestly think he has. Um, again, this is my opinion. I'm not 100 percent sure on what in the world is going on. But in my opinion, um he has, but and I will support Chris and I will support EXO. And on to the EXO update. Apparently that well, there is auto, I did hear it. It wasn't you couldn't hear it very well, but there is some auto of how singing in SM, a few songs, um, which was, I think, Kiss, and, um, another song that is, actually, that's a good song, right, um, apparently he has some, Christmas Day, Kiss You Goodbye, and Full Snow. Um, I think that's the only song. Please don't get mad at me. Um, but 
but I have photo auto. It I will link it down below if I need to. I will link it down below definitely. Um, you can kind of hear him. Apparently, he was singing and crying. Um, he did upload a photo on Instagram. Hopefully, it was him. We don't know. Um, and if it was, and it's a new photo, he does not. In my opinion, this is my opinion. Um, he does not not look well. And yes, Chris, Chris has a lot of stuff going, but also the EXO members have. Tons of stuff on, cause those stuck in the middle of it on being Chris's side or listening to SM, and it's just really ridiculous on how it's all going, and the rumors are just getting ridiculous. Again, still rumors about back home is Matt and this then other members being hit or whatever. Again, these are rumors, guys. Don't. Believe it, you don't know if it's true. Um, not until we get a statement from SM, all you Chris, and again, you don't even know if some statements are true. So, all in, all in the end, the truth might come out, the truth might not. And I just feel like SM has really messed up. You know, they all been on TV because of the vicious rumors. I don't know. But, Again, if any of this does come out true about Chris's fault, this, that, and the other thing, honestly, SM is it. Because if you look at no, if you look at in the past of everything, because even the past is coming back up if you look at it, because people are saying like Gum and Shingy, um, with the DBFK and JYJ, and then you bring up the thing that happened with Super Junior with one of the members leaving. It's just, it's gonna bite them in the butt if they keep doing what they're doing, and SM is just gonna keep digging a hole for themselves. And they ain't gonna get out of it sooner or later. Um, so honestly, I, I do not stand for SM, I do not like SM. The artists, the groups, yes, they have amazing groups like SM and Super Junior and Shiny. And um, go generation. But at the end, SM as an entertainment is the shit in my book. Again, that's my opinion. That's my thoughts. That's how I feel. Of again, like I said, no, I was not a fan of when JYJ and DSK and the whole thing and that, but. Doing research and hearing things and stuff and reading on it. It's just weird and now with this with Chris. Who knows? Um, I'm gonna support still yet because as eleven members, um, because like I said, they must be going through a lot. And I have seen apparently photos of the members leaving. SM and if they are real photos and stuff, I feel really bad for them because they honestly look so sad and depressed and just so stressed. And again, I'm not saying they are real photos or not. I mean, I'm not saying they are real photos or not. Sorry, I'm really tongue tied. Um, but in the end. Chris and EXO do need our support and they need you all, they need our love and hopefully this will cool down but honestly at the moment I don't see it cooling down anytime soon just because of the fandom and EXO fans are uh, taking some stuff a little too far and we just need to see proof on all of this, what is being said, what is going on. And, and like I have said in my little part of the society to the but what else matters is Chris and EXO being healthy and happy soon because with all this and the stress, it's not good for them. And 
apparently they are still doing a consult as 11 members and also apparently SM did contact Chris but Chris has not contacted back which I don't believe at all I really don't believe that SM has tried to contact Chris and if they have Chris ain't gonna contact that because that's just not I don't see that ever happening again that's another rumor there's so many rumors going on about Chris and everyone in SM or everyone in EXO not everyone in SM but um, along with the staff that it is really sad and yes um it's just really crazy and sorry that was my mom and I don't know I, I just wish it would cool down but at the end it's not at the moment because oh I'm sorry I'm too much on my mom and she has to be um Oh my hand. But put your guys' opinion down below, please, and let me know what you think on all this about Chris's apparently hot problem. Again, it could be true because of the stress and working all the time and from crazy hours from like three in the morning to three in the next morning. You know, honestly, no. Whatever what happens behind closed doors, you never know the truth and. We may never know the truth until who knows maybe a long, long time. But if it does turn out true and they do take this to court, well, apparently, of course they are, but and this comes true in court about Chris's health condition and stuff, SM is messed up. But, and then, again, <laughs> I was going to say, Chris and XO, all of them. Of eleven members of EXO and Chris, we all support and love and stand by the sides no matter what. So leave you guys comment below and let me know what you guys think. So this video is again a long one, but I'll talk to you later for another update. Bye.